A day of fast-moving developments in the James Crumbly involuntary manslaughter trial. The defense presenting just one witness today before resting its case, and James Crumbly telling the judge it's his decision to remain silent rather than testify. Then came closing arguments and instructions to the jury, which deliberated for about an hour and a half. They will resume tomorrow morning. Sean Lay live at the Oakland County Courthouse. Sean, you got the chance to speak with the mother of one of the Oxford victims. Right after these intense closing arguments, Karen, you are exactly right. This is the mother of Madison Baldwin. Take a look. Yeah, uh, really, I just hope they take away all the, the facts and the testimonies from everybody and, you know, just look at the evidence. You know, the evidence is there. The testimony is there. It's very clear. Um, and I just really hope they take that into respect that, you know, we want the justice just like anybody else does. Nicole Beausoleil, mother of Madison Baldwin, reacting after intense emotional closing arguments in the James Crumley trial from hearing from Crumley himself about taking the stand. It is my decision to remain silent. To prosecutors arguing Crumley failed the four Oxford kids and their parents. Crumley's defense, school officials and Crumley did not see the shooter as a threat. It's it's not really hard to hear the defense. It's it's hard to relive it every single time. That's the that's the hardest thing. Um, you know, just every time you see something, it's it's different. Every time you hear something, it's different, and it just gets harder and harder. You don't have to go find it. You don't have to go buy it. It was provided. It was right there. You just watched me do it. But the final image left with this jury, prosecutor Karen McDonald putting the cable lock on the murder weapon. I thought that was compelling. It shows, and our theme was, there were just so many little things that could have been done to prevent this tragedy, that being one of them and one of the simplest. Less than 10 seconds to do what was right. Back here live, that's Wolfgang Mueller, attorney for Nicole Beausoleil, the mother of Madison Baldwin. Also spoke with the father of Justin Schilling, the father of Madison Baldwin after closing arguments. Both had a lot of emotion, uh, trying to just stay strong. Of course, they said they may speak to us when there's a verdict. So, Karen, when will there be a verdict? That's the big question everyone wants to know. 9 a.m. tomorrow, the jury will be here. Will they come back with that verdict tomorrow? We'll be right here if they do. Back to you. All right, always appreciate it. Thank you, Sean.